Hello, welcome to draw the name piece of the pick an ellipse to create a circle holding down control to get a perfect circle. Okay, to create the gears, you just use the rectangle tool like create a small square. Okay, just and hold shift and align the boot item to center. Okay, now to rotate this gear roundabout we'll use the transform tool so how do we get to calculate how many gears is the make up this logo so 360 degrees which is a perfect circle divided by by 20 so that will give us an angle of 18 degrees so when we rotate this angle so we enter the angle of 18 degrees okay it's so now you have to make sure that you define the center so the center of this object is actually going to be the circle because that's the part you want to rotate to so you click on apply you can choose to apply all of them at the same time, but I'm just applying one after the other so you see the process. So that is it. So click and select all the object and weld. Perfect. So you can see we have the gear. So to create the other part of the logo, just create another circle. Right, align it to the center, increase it to whatever desired size you have. So you hold Shift and Control, left click to duplicate. So we have the first circle red and we have the green one, by the outer one is the yellow. As you can see, our logo is getting into shape. Okay, so the next thing we are going to do. I just increase the point size, whatever size that suits you, is to fit text to path. We're going to fit text to path, so we have the word and everything. So let's type out the characters Nigerian National Petroleum. Petroleum Corporation. Okay. Perfect. So you just reduce this a little bit and then since we have both separate text, one is above and the other is beneath, I just break them and then go to the text menu, choose fit text to part, just point the circle. So, okay, now to apply the one under, we have to break the first one apart from the circle so we can be able to make the second one. Beautiful, so you can see. Now go to the property bar and you can actually rotate, mirror this, and click and drag to adjust it. Okay. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to drop a comment in the comment section below. If you find this video interesting, give it a thumbs up and share. This would help somebody out there. Okay. So um, I want to adjust this, and uh, you can as you can see it's getting into the gears. So what do we do? To solve this, um, let me just reduce the inner circle a little bit so I have more space. Okay, this is perfect. You can break it apart. 
you choose to okay so this is actually all it takes to make this circle all right and then fit text to path So I just use a circle and make those um, dots around here. For the inner part of this uh, logo, they're just made up of lines. Okay, if you are not sure how these lines are done, I'm going to make another video on uh, the pen tool and the bizarre tool. So those are just simple ways you can just make lines with them so if you're new to my channel please consider subscribing and turn on the notification bell so you'll be the first to get notified whenever we upload a new video so this is all for today thank you for watching see you in my next video